In 100 to 150 years, this will be a fully grown beech tree. Or maybe not. Beech trees are not made for the heat and droughts we expect for the future. We're in the midst of global problems that require science-based knowledge and concrete action. In forest research, we therefore work closely with practitioners. They need to know today which species will be viable in different locations in a hundred years' time. Whether oak or white fir will have a better chance than beech or spruce. Nature doesn't need us to intervene. If one species fails, a new one prevails. Nature doesn't care, but we humans do. Our forest fulfills many essential functions. It serves as a filter, air conditioning system and reservoir for carbon and water. It provides us with wood and protects us from natural hazards. The forest is also a recreational space and its diversity is a source of wonder for us. In our unique plant protection lab, we scrutinize native and introduced organisms using the most rigorous safety measures. Some harmful microorganisms have yet to be identified, while others we know very well. These organisms are not welcome here because they would cause devastating damage to our native plants. This in turn would have severe ecological and economic consequences. The forest is WSL's largest research area. We cooperate with scientific institutions all over the world to study it. We research how adaptable our forests are. The annual rings formed by trees let us look back thousands of years. We investigate how we can manage forest resources sustainably, how the forest floor stores carbon and the role of organisms. We know a great deal about the health of forests in Switzerland and how intensively we can harvest them while still avoiding negative consequences. Swiss wood is therefore always a good choice. The forest is important for Switzerland. Let's use it together sustainably.